Victor Hedman and Boris Astana lace him up against Yugra. Already down 1 0, just two minutes in. Boris gets it back. Talga Jailaulov storms in, passes to Vadim Kroznoslabotsev, and he puts it home 1 1. I bet Kroznoslabotsev is your favorite name in the case, Steve. Oh, you bet, Andre. Boris comes out red hot in the second frame, and they get another goal. Dustin Boyd, slightly easier name, shoots the puck. Rebound to Fedor Palashuk, who gets the goal. 2 1, Boris. Polishuk with his second of the season and Boyd gets his 11th assist. Less than two minutes later, Jailaulov with the puck again. This time he doesn't look for options, he shoots, he scores 3-1. Jailaulov gets his seventh of the season. He's one of Boris's key players, but he had an off-season last year. Good to see him doing well again. Two minutes after that, Maxim Spirodonov makes it 4-1 and Mikhail Birukov waves at the bench, he wants out. He was waving after the third goal too, maybe they should have listened to him. Edgar Smoselskis comes onto the ice, but Boris is just unstoppable. The puck is in the slot and Roman Savchenko cranks it 5-1. It took them 20 seconds to ruin Moselski's mood. Savchenko scores his third of the year and Jela Ulov picks up another assist. Less than five minutes left to play in the second. This play just shows how hungry Boris was for goals in this one. Konstantin Rudenko chases Denis Grabishkov, steals it and makes it 6-1. Rudenko scores his tens of the year and this goal partially explains why Grabishkov was straight up from SKA this season. That's all Boris would need in this game. 6-2 final.